All right, why don't we take advantage? Why don't we take advantage? We have, at least we have got a, a real nice ceiling here. We've got great visibility. Why don't we take advantage of that on the way back to the airport here? And we can demonstrate maybe a, a couple of aileron rolls, maybe followed by a loop or two. What do you Absolutely, John. All right, so the first maneuver we can take a look at, let's just take a look at a at an aileron roll. So the aileron roll with this Atabri is very simply, we're going to, it's a full throttle, full throttle maneuver as the nose goes down for the horizon. We're pitching down, looking for 130, 130, possibly maybe even 135, 135 miles per hour. Okay. At the time we attain the speed, we pitch up approximately 30 degrees, 30 degrees, nose up, and then full ailerons in the direction our hearts desire to go in, followed by the appropriate rudder, right? Enough rudder to maintain coordination. Okay. All right, so I have Sebago Lake in front of us, right? Big picture. I have the Atlantic Ocean on the right, and White Mountains on the left. Like I say, it's a big, it's a big, big picture. Okay, I'm going to join you. I'm going to join you on the controls here. Okay. And uh, the power is coming full and nosing down, right? I'm just going to reset the G meter here so we can basically just evaluate the, the Gs that we, that we have for the recovery. 120 and 130, 135, and... Going up, looking outside on the wing, and there's 30 degrees all the way around she goes. Just the right amount of rudder. Look at Sebago Lake. And pull up, pull up, pull up, right back to 5,500, right where we started the maneuver. All right, so, so you can see as far as the coordination goes, right, I was, well, I was making my best attempt to apply just the right amount of rudder to maintain some you know, some coordination. Are right, you have full control? Uh, full control. Yes. Are you looking at the wing? Or I am. I'm, use, I'm looking at the bottom of the wing, right, to basically give me testimony as to what the, of what the pitch is doing on the airplane. Okay. Okay. So I hold the uh, full to the left aileron input to the whole turn? You betcha. Yeah, the, the Satabri doesn't have a whole lot of aileron authority to begin with, so we need we need every every bit of aileron that we can possibly get for the roll authority. All right, nose down, nose down, nose down. Yeah, that's it. Looking for 130, 135, nose down, nose down. There's 130, and pitch up. Pitch up, pitch up, that's me joining on a control, pitch up, and all the way over. That's me holding back pressure, load her up, load her up, load her up, and there we are, right back, you have full control. Uh, full control. Right, so it really is about an outside an outside reference, isn't it, to a great deal of, I am using the base of the wing, that flat bottom wing gives me great orientation for pitch control, right? Sure. And then as far as the, the roll authority, right, I need all of the roll authority that the airplane has to offer. Right, I'm going to join you on the controls, okay? And let's go ahead and, this is a clearing turn, looking off to the, looking off to the west, back to the north. All right, scanning the skies left and right, and there we are, looking down, pitching down right. I'm joining you on the controls now, pitching down, we'll do one together. Okay. All right, there's 120, nose down, and 130, 135, nose up, look outside, there's my 30 degrees, all the way around she goes, right, nose up, nose up. And a little too heavy on the rudder toward the tail end there, but uh, not too not too shabby. Back up to back up to 5,500. Okay. okay. These clearing turns have very short expiration dates on them, don't they? So I don't like to take too long to clear the area. I like to get a nice crisp, clear, you know, clear shot of of all of my surroundings, and then be able to start the maneuver. All right. You ready? I'm um, ready. Full power. Nose down. more nose down. There's 120 and 130. 135. Nose up, nose up, nose up, nose up. And there's 30 all the way. A little rudder, little aileron all the way. And just hold it in there. Because if you start to take it out, you start to take her at that input a little too early, what, what happens is you can actually, you have full control now, is what will happen is you'll actually sustain then the roll, the airplane will stop rolling and one would just wind up doing something of more of a split S than anything else. Okay. All right, so just a just a safety clearing turn here before we head back to the airport. There's 140 coming up, and all the way up through the top of the loop. Looking outside, right there we are in the top of the top of the loop. There's there's the surface, right? Load her up, 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 and ah, there we go. All right, we're all clear for the Sanford Airport at this time. 
And you have full control. I have full control. I just wanted to get that one last uh, clearing turn in there, even though it was vertical.